work here again and I was playing around and had an idea to be able to control our Christmas light show outside by a laser and what I wanted to do kind of the goal of what I wanted to do was when a car drives through the laser the show will start finish and then stop and then when you break the laser again it's kind of like one of those garage door things it that's kind of what my goal was and so I was building it and so I got a mouse and it's just wireless mouse here's the adapter and I'm gonna relay right here this what are the wires going into the mouse there I basically widen up to this button to the left click button to basically pause this remote play the show how'd you wire them up I basically just soldered them soldered the wires in to the mouse and screwed it back together put batteries in it disabled the moving around laser so I cut the light out of the laser so there's no kind of light in there to move the mouse around so go all I want like this it won't do anything all it does is just click a button and then I wired it up to a relay and this relay is kind of inverted well there it goes it just did some whatever okay Wait, hold on yeah well okay I forgot it was active but um basically it goes into the relay and it's inverted so when the relay is on it won't keep pressing the mouse button when the relay is off it will just keep continuously pressing the mouse button then I have that wired up to a light sensor so there's a light sensor here. I prototyped this in snap circuits because you have a light sensor. Goes into, if you can see here, it's an NPN transistor. And basically what happens is when there's light, current will pass through. And so there's no light right now. But when I have my laser pointer, I just hope it didn't have any batteries. When I pointed it here, you'll well, it's hard to hold still. But I'll get this still. There you go. Okay. You here, and then when I take it off, the relay will click. So how to demonstrate this is, I've gone, I went, in, have it hooked up to my computer, I made my Minecraft server. You can see I'm on Buttercraft. Um, and if I basically, I'm gonna basically, well, hold on, let me fix this hole. Let's build up here a little bit. Okay, so I'm up here, and when I have my laser, my laser's on. I'm going to basically point it right into the light sensor. Nothing's going to happen. When I let go, my guy will start breaking bugs. When I turn back on, when the laser goes back, it will stop. And I'll keep going. And that's basically it. This light right here. Well, stop my character. But um, the light right here is just for me to know whether it's on or off. So if it's shining in. To know when I get it on target or not. So I'm going to put this outside. And then it's going to. Like mouse basically. And that's all it does. Thank you guys for watching. And subscribe. Again. And this is Bradley. Friend. Hello. Um, and Spock. And Stop. I hooked up. Our light. Thank thing. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. Um, the contraption thing. of the Eric. More so. Okay. okay. And so what's it going to do? Basically, when you walk through our doorway, it will turn on the pumpkin and our whole light show in theory. Okay, and explain how it works. Basically, it uses my circuit I showed in the other video. Okay. Uh, we got a laser. I don't want to bump it. Laser with a battery pack. Then we got an old mouse hooked up with a relay and a light sensor with duct tape over it to keep it dark. Speakers, wires, wireless mouse. Yeah. Okay. okay. It's a bunch of junk, basically. Just Hold slammed on. together. Okay, Bradley. You do the honors. Walk through it. It isn't by standard walking through it. Welcome to the Goldie Family Super Bowl party. Please come in. We hope you will have the very front. Oh, God.